Hello folks, greetings. This is the presentation made on behalf of Shanti Kumar V. He is a 3 plus decades global IT experienced professional. Worked in different countries through the top IT services companies. Out of his 3 decades experience, for 15 years he worked in software testing professions for Fortune 100 clients globally through top IT services companies, for different business domains. His strong skills were proven in his past companies on building the project's team's capabilities as per the client expectations. Many places he and his teams got the customer satisfaction ratings, CSAT, as 5 out of 5. The teams used to get promotions faster than others. You can use Google search to get his detailed profile on internet or LinkedIn. Now, let us come to our current topic. Modern Testing Professional Skills Upgrade this course was designed to educate the test analyst on the following with my past project level experiences as examples. Where this course can work as skills brush up for their job interviews. 1. Basic testing process for a test analyst need to follow. 2. The concepts of Agile slash Scrum with some scenarios discussion, I have used my online session video. 3. The SDLC and Agile testing process with examples 4. The effective test automation process by example, the process is explained through test scenarios of an e-commerce application for a right project delivery without failure. 5. Introduction to cloud concepts with AWS, I have used my online session video. 6. Some of the AWS services labs slash POCs as below, from my self-exercises and my students' POC demos. A. How to create default EC2, a virtual machine of AWS. B. How to access EC2 from the SSH of Linux. C. I am role slash group slash users creation and testing the access permissions. D. Creation of S3 bucket slash objects and sharing in static URL to access by public. E. Applying a cross region replication, CRR, in S3 for bucket slash objects sharing as POC. F. Creating a MySQL server with EC2 Linux as POC and testing with sample database by using SQLs. G. Creating two AWS accounts and share the S3 buckets across the accounts. This is my student POC presented well with detailed steps as a part of my coaching. H. You will see how to install slash configure a WordPress website and VPC network with two-tier architecture. Please note all are related with labs slash practices on a particular and for setup. If you want to know the concepts of the above you need to browse the online AWS documentation. Where they have extensively explained. 7. DevOps and C-Tool, Jenkins installation. In projects they follow DevOps which is the advanced deployment slash delivery model of Agile. In this section I have elaborated, what were the IT project delivery issues we used to face in the past. Why do we need to follow DevOps for a project delivery? What way it can help to the organization slash people and customers? Then I also added on the typical DevOps roles and activities video. Later you can see one of the popular C tools, Jenkins installation demo. Good luck with the core. By Shanti Kumar Vamilapalli. Now, let us see slide 2. A modern testing professional skills upgrade course on Kumar's Academy. Visit URL https colon slash slash elearnkumar.coreserious.com slash with test process slash agile slash scrum slash automation process AWS cloud. This course was designed to educate the test analyst on the market demanding skills with my past project level experiences designed as examples. Where this course also can work as skills brush up for their job interviews. Many cloud labs were presented to support for your project test environment setup learning. The test automation process elaboration gives to implement automation in a methodical way with defect free. S pause second equals 1 E. Pause. Now, let us see slide 3. Slide 3. What are the course table of contents? Lecture 1, recap the basic testing process. Lecture 2, Agile slash Scrum concepts. Lecture 3, testing an SDLC with Agile. Lecture 4, test automation process. Lecture 5, introduction to cloud and AWS. Lecture 6. Some of the AWS labs and POC samples. Lecture 7, 
Why do we need DevOps in a software project and how to set up Jenkins in a Linux VM? Now, let us see slide 4. S pause second equals 1E. Pause. Slide 4. What are the benefits of this course? 1. Nowadays, the modern cloud and DevOps technology with infrastructure automation has more demand. 2. The test engineers are joining with the DevOps engineers to build the test environment on cloud technology towards software testing phases test execution. 3. I have made this course with the testing process, test automation process, agile slash scrum process slash roles, cloud concepts and the AWS minimal services operation like creating a VM, using it from your Linux machine, creating S3 bucket and objects sharing them on URL. Creating S3 cross-region replication and cross-account sharing as POC. 4. Creating MySQL Server as POC. Creating a two-tier architecture set up with a web server slash VPC components as POC. With these POCs one can be confident on cloud test environment setup. 5. The DevOps concepts with C slash CD. And the Jenkins C tool setup in a Linux VM. 6. These can help a testing professional for interviews well on test environment preparation using AWS. 7. Even if you are being asked to do the labs during the interviews you will be able to do with these demos. Folks, I appreciate on your time watching this video. Now, look into the course. Good luck in your learning.